new at 11. Bellevue police are stepping up their patrols by adding the SWAT team. It is a push to cut crime in the downtown core. Camera 7 Eastside reporter Allison Grandy is live for us tonight in Bellevue with a story you'll hear only on Cairo 7. And Allison, they say it's already having an impact. It is, Lindsay, and these are some of the department's most elite officers. They left their other assignments to join this patrol squad. They're focusing on areas of high density, like here along Bellevue Way. And while they may be hard to spot, sometimes working undercover, they want criminals to know they know exactly who they're looking for. So it's been all hands on deck since about December 1. The SWAT team is now on patrol in Bellevue. Leo 8425. We're six SWAT guys. The new downtown unit is made up of veteran officers. We work in three two man cars. Hello. We found SWAT officers Andy Smith and Jim Keene on patrol around Bellevue Square for a busy holiday shopping and returning day. They're ready to swoop into critical incidents to help patrol officers. We've been working together for a long time now, and uh, we, it's the body language. We, we can anticipate each other's moves, what we're thinking, just by an affliction of a voice, right? What's up, dude? One of their main focuses is retail theft, not a simple shoplift, but the organized crime rings who come to Bellevue to target retailers. There's dead giveaways, right? Earlier this month, we obtained this video of two women shoplifting at Bellevue Square. Detectives say they stole electronics and hid them in their big purses. Here, one of them stuffed a coat under her sweater. Mall security and patrol officers responded, but it was the SWAT team who stopped their car blocks away with $18,000 worth of stolen merchandise inside. These highly trained, specialized SWAT team members are coming in full force to back up the patrol units. For Smith, with nearly 18 years on the force, it's personal. So you know the city. You know. We watch it grow up. We've kind of grown up together. The population is getting bigger. The odds are something might be, might happen. We're readily available, and we can bring a lot of assets to uh, to a problem, resolve it quicker than we have in the past. The SWAT team has been on the street here in Bellevue for about a month. They're still waiting for it to be a little longer before they can get us any exact data on how much crime they've actually impacted. They're able to have this unit because for the first time in several years, the Bellevue Police Department is fully staffed. Live in Bellevue, Allison Grandy, Cairo 7 News. All right.